And the following year, Taj, the responsibility kind of fell to yourself, Drew, and Steve, and I guess what Sleepy would be, a couple of the remaining stars on that team. How did you guys take that responsibility in trying to go back to the Final Four? Uh, it was it was tough, you know, because we had been to the Final Four, you know, as a sophomore, won it as a junior, and then come back and we had a pretty veteran-laden team with me, myself, Steve, and Drew, uh, and Sleepy, who had been there the year before. You know, everybody was taking their best shot, shot at us because we were the defending national champs. But at the same time, we were giving our, our very own best shot. You know, so it was hard because we had a new group of guys that were freshmen that didn't quite understand what it took to be successful. And they learned as the season got on and, and they got better. But it takes time to understand what it takes to win at a high level. And, you know, not, not knocking those guys, but we didn't have the, the parts to do it. Again, I mean, we did a pretty good job. We got to the Sweet 16 and probably should have won the game against Michigan State where we lost by one, had a chance at the end yep. to win it. But, you know, it was, it was a fun ride, but it was tough at the same time trying to prepare those guys for Coach Williams, for Maryland, for the ACC, and at the same time trying to win games. personally at the University of Maryland. It's nothing, nothing ever like it in the history of my career. And I talk about it all the time. And uh, can each one of y'all get one moment in your two years that we all been teammates, uh, Marty says one year, uh, by any experience well, funny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about the University of Maryland. Yeah, so just, just give me one moment that you had is funny, Silly, crazy that you a can bar remember. Moment? Yeah, yeah bar moment. Because, oh, because yeah. let me tell you, yeah. I wanted to give yeah. you that because yeah. I want to give you all the opportunity because yeah. every week Byron gives us a different story about one of you guys. Exactly. And we don't have any stories about Byron. <laughs> right. the, be the best Byron yeah. stories yeah. are from when Byron didn't even play. Because yeah. when Byron had a salary when he transferred, he was on the you know the, the scout team, and I wasn't a starter. I was on the scout team with Byron, and we used to bust there yeah. every day. And yeah. I don't even believe it, but yeah. like Byron said. The depth that we had on that team was yep. embarrassing. Yep. I mean, you guys all know. I mean, yeah. We had tons of depth, and, and those guys, you know, we pushed them every day. So yep. uh, hearing Coach Williams saying, you know, stop that blankety blank, yeah. you know, Mouton, this, this guy, <laughs> who the hell do you think he is coming in here and busting our butts? I mean, every every day when you got to be, say he had to be, they were playing back there. Yeah. I can't even, but, but yeah. he'd be, you know, one guy, say you were yeah. Carowell. Will Solomon. Will Solomon. Yeah, Chris like Carowell. You know, Josh he'd have, Howard. He'd have, he'd have the neon green light. Yeah. And, and <laughs> yeah. Give it. And, yeah. you know, when, you're, when you're one of those role players, if yeah. you're playing the role of the other team, yeah. you know, the neon green light, you just go and shoot and shoot and neon, shoot. Neon, I like that. And he just bust him up. Yeah. And coach would go insane. Yeah. I, I can't remember who we play, but uh, my moment would be, Mouton hit a three-pointer and come down to half court to a backflip. Me and <laughs> who was that? Who was that we played? Huh? I have no idea. I have no idea. I think it had to be over the summer. Or yeah, 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 he, he did a backflip in the I game and Gary Williams went crazy. <laughs> so I was like, hurt himself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I was like, Damn. then I was like, then it's like, yo, you see that? I, like, I don't think Mouton just did no backflip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so we bring up the John Howard stuff. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah, we were that up. Uh, at the tournament. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you want to do that? I'll, well, I'll start with you my, my moment yeah, yeah. first. Yeah. Uh, I might not want to bring that up. One of, yeah, one of the yeah, first. Yeah, you might not, because he in D.C. Yeah. <laughs> one, one of the first weeks, I guess, we were working out, and uh, we had just got done, you know, with the workout. Actually, probably playing pickup. Yeah. And I'm sitting in my locker, you know, just, you know, chilling, downtime. And all of a sudden, here, do, 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 do,
do. Coming through the door, doing a front barrel roll. Oh yeah. Is Byron Mouton into the locker room and <laughs> that, pretends like he's shooting, all, shooting us all up. And yeah, I was like, yeah, this yeah. dude is yeah. legitimately crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and then you, you know, know then he'd run in, do a, like a front somersault yeah. and spring up like he was gonna, you know, shoot somebody. <laughs> this was pre Gilbert Arenas. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The this yeah. one, this was cool. And then one time, I never forget, I dove in the locker room because you know my whole thing was Coach Williams and Coach Passo said we don't have no personality on this team. Nobody's do anything. Everybody got the stone look. So my thing is, you know, I try to bring some personality to the team. I dove over the locker room the first time. I dove, I dove over the locker room, start barking at everybody. We're not gonna talk about the website. Yeah. We're not gonna talk about the website. Yeah. So Byron in the ACC tournament. Yeah. We were playing Wake Forest, and Josh Howard was a pretty good player. Yeah, very good player. Yeah. And you know, tough game, going in halftime. Mutan's getting under his skin. And, uh, you know, we're going in and we kind of have to walk by each other. And, you know, uh, Josh Howard's just talking trash. Yeah. Wutan's like, put him up, put him up. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is wrong? <laughs> and, you know, we have to defend him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sometimes yeah. I'm like, man, this guy's just made a little too crazy. Hey, I never forget this. I think that's your boy, or School to Cheryl's boy. Uh, we go in there, we play the same term, NCAA tur I mean, uh, in, uh, uh, ACC. ACC tournament. We come in in the tunnel in Crawford. Wanted to jump over the rail and tried to fight me, man. It's a lot of guys didn't like me because I was a dirty player, man. Yeah, yeah, I was a dirty was player. Dirty. dirty player, man. Yeah, I was no, dirty. I'm, I'm yeah, dirty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Someone so address that. I'm not yeah, interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was leave, leave, leave that in. Leave that in. Chris, all, all of us who remember you here at Maryland, remember you trying to dunk everything from the three-point line on in. I remember at a UNC game, you caught the ball at half court. I don't even know if you dribbled. Took one. Took one, so you know exactly what yeah, yeah. <laughs> Might have took one dribble and then ran and, and, and dunked the ball. How much of that do you still have? How much of that bounce do you still have? And why did we ever never see you in the NBA dunk contest? I, you know, I ain't, I don't know. <laughs> I ain't, you know, I'm not, uh, I ain't it's tougher, big man. Dunk yeah. contest ready. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. I could do it on the court. A lot of people really do and it. They are and there. I just can't yeah. really do it, you know, up and down on the court. Yeah. You know what I mean? But uh, I think, I mean, I don't know. It was cool just dunking everything because that's all I could do at the time. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, all right, you better get it where you can. I'm just get it right here. I'm just going to dunk it every time. You yeah. know, we had a lot of good shooters, so it wasn't need for me to shoot the ball. So I just dunk everything. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What, uh, you know, at a point that Ty, I mean Taj, a point that Mike touched on, and uh, first first opportunity to play professional ball in Europe, and I had two contracts on the table, one contract in Italy, one contract in Germany, and they told me my teammate was Mike Hook Hook Shot <laughs> Marty Sitch. <laughs> yeah, they say there's no way that I'm going to Italy. I'm going to be my teammate Mike Mike Marty Sitch. And uh, like, yeah, it was a great time. First year playing professional ball, Mike Bartis was my teammate. It was a great experience. I had a lot of fun, man. And like I always say till this day, that Germany was probably the best place I ever played for, played at. And cause you know, Mike Bartis came in, first time you're playing in Europe, showed me the ropes, you know, helped me out. You know, it's tough, you know, the language barrier. And he definitely helped me out, man. Definitely, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man. One, more, one more question and get out of here for all you yeah. guys. Everybody has rings. Where are your rings at? Man, I got my little baby ring. <laughs> I mean, don't be mad at me because I brought this out. Yeah, yeah, I, I wouldn't. I've seen you all the time, and I've never seen you yeah, ring. You yeah. know where? Never. Well, well, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you a story. I, I never said this. I keep this low key, man. I never forget this. The last day I was in. <laughs> <laughs> the last day. The last day I was in my dorm. I had all my little rings on top of my TV. I packed it up. Never see it again. I don't know what what happened to it. I had my high school you rings. You real don't know where they are? I don't, don't know, know where they are. You don't have your national championship yeah. ring? No, I don't have nothing. No. I don't know where they are. I packed it up off my TV, and I tell I tell my mom and all that. Hmm? Yeah, <laughs> the big 64 inch. <laughs> Better look yeah. out for that on the Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I had a 64-inch TV in a 12 by 12. <laughs> Chris, do you ever wear your ring? Yeah. No, my mom keep all this. Yeah, one. yeah. Chris doesn't wear his because he doesn't match with any of his other pair. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I wear it on occasional, you know, uh, that coach I go out recruiting. Oh, you got to wear it, yeah. Huh? Yeah. But uh, I, I rarely don't, you know, I don't wear it just Sorry, I don't, I'm aware it, you know, it means a lot to me and something that I don't want to lose, so I keep it where I know where it is and it's home. And 
my wife can keep an eye out on it. Yeah. So. All right, gentlemen. Well, thank you all very much for joining Thanks, us man. on the Bob and Moose Town Show. We look forward to catching up to you guys again individually. <laughs> yeah. And you all know how to get in touch with Moose Town. Moose, anything to say to your teammates? Yeah, man. It was a pleasure, man. Every time I see you guys, man, y'all put you a smile. Get better looking. Yeah, y'all get better looking. I always put a smile. I'm always excited to see my teammates because, like I say, it was one of the best experiences I ever had. But just to let you guys know, man, I know Marty has got a little seed. I don't know about Chris and Ty, but when y'all get him, yeah, when y'all get him, Bring them to me. Oh, I, I that that oh, 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 oh. <laughs> not ready. No, no, oh, not yet, not yet, not yet. Like the audience got to be a little bigger. The okay. audience got to be a little bigger. All right, all right. But uh, yeah, you know, sixman.com. You know, go six man. Like I said, we doing a lot of stuff, man. And uh, like I said, when y'all get your seeds, I know Boy Street already got one. Bring them to me. I develop them. Right, um, when you get the program, you can send them to me. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks again, man, for y'all coming on the show. Oh yeah, come on, man, teammates, baby. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm still in recession. Yeah, yeah.